Hi it's Hazy and welcome to my channel. Today I am showing you how to do some whimsical owls. These are the ones I've already done. I'll show you how to draw the, some of the styles okay but I've also got this. I'm going to put it on Kofi so you can have it um, to copy or to... I'm going to put it on community as well I think. Um, so you can have it to copy and you can also... Um, be inspired or you can actually use it yourself in your own journals just don't say it's your it, it, it just don't say it's your own work that's all that i really ask um and obviously don't give copies of it to other people right okay so that some of the things i'm doing today are these okay so i'll show you how to draw these today and um i'm going to put them on my I'll show you what to do later okay in the thing so please give me a thumbs up if you'd like to join me today and uh, subscribe to my channel thank you so much and please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already um okay so let's go and I'll show you what I'm doing today um right so what I'm going to do today is some whimsical owls and just give you some pointers on how to look oh, there's my scissors you yeah. uh, and how to uh, doodle or draw them if you like you don't need any uh, drawing skills it's one of those again because I'm going to tell you how to um, what shapes to use and all that okay so because this is so cute and I'm going to um, these look like the ch no, they look like they've been cut out of a children's book let's get them a bit so I get them a bit close a minute oh yeah don't, don't switch it off because the buttons there oh that was <laughs> I actually cut that one out wrong. Uh, <laughs> that's the only one I did. Uh, these look like they're out of a children's book, don't they? Cut directly, so I suppose you could do that as well. And even copy the um, designs. But anyway, they are. Look, and then there's your, um, there's your mini ones as well. Or mi they are, I've got, um, say that one I've got there. And I've got the mini version there. Of course I have. Yay. And I'll tell you what else I did as well. Oh, and I'll tell you where I got the idea from to, uh, I don't know, I don't know why I got the inspiration, but there's a lady called Mary Flower. I don't think she does videos anymore, but she did this amazing, <laughs> obviously didn't do anything to do with owls, but she did amazing um, journal. And I saw on her channel she got some sort of cushion that got owls on it. And I'm not sure, I don't even watch that, but I watched, oh, I loved it, absolutely loved it. She's a Mary Flower and it's a um, whimsical journal. And if you look through the flip, she, it's not even finished, but oh, wow, how inspirational. This is, I don't know, is it cartridge paper? Smooth heavyweight. Uh, I don't know, whatever it is, with <laughs> weight paper. I don't, I don't actually finish up with using this anyway. These are all the bits I've been using. So I think that's gotten on to one. Okay, so you can see my owls there. So hopefully I'll use this bit in the middle to draw. All right, I've got a crayon there. That might do it. You might be able to see that a bit better. I don't really need to rub it out. That's what I'm thinking. I hope not. Anyway, because I, um, right. I think the best one to draw is actually something like that, even though that went wrong, because I've cut the feet off. <laughs> and is it this one? No, that that one yet. I'm gonna do. Um, let me show you how to do this one. This one's probably the easiest one. Okay, it's like um, all it is is this. And in fact, you could also um create templates if you like this like the style of one of them you've done you could actually draw around a template you've made so that's not perfect in fact it's more perfect than that isn't it i mean that's more perfect than this rather so there we go right so what i did was then do i that's a bit lower than his but that doesn't matter because we don't have to create the same owls all the time do we Right, okay, so, oh yeah, well, let's do the uh, wings. Okay, wings. And then you've got your eyes. You always have to have big, big eyes. Well, <laughs> you don't have to, but it looks more owl-like to have big eyes. I've done a tummy there. Okay, uh, or, I don't know what, what, what do Americans call tummy? 
subscribers and because I'm I know that Americans uh, watch my channel the most I do some big fee you can do them smaller than that in fact I have okay so then you can decide whatever colour you like you can paint it that's quite a good idea painting it's a good idea um, if you want to get your paints out I'm going to separate the head as well so I'm going to separate it with that shape that'll do uh, this will do won't it a brown one yeah we can do a brown one I don't know what colour it is it is sand actually so you can do a sand one <laughs> there we go and I've left that white look at the eyes so you can do it you like okay it's going to quickly do that yay right okay you can draw it as carefully or as rough as you like it's up to you it, it can look like a child drawing which i think <laughs> Oh, this Mary flower, her grandkids were amazing. I'll tell you that. Right, so what I'm going to do now is doing some outlining as well. So I'm going to do some pupils like this. Because I haven't drawn it in black, I'm, because normally I just draw it in black. But because I haven't, I'm going to outline it. Okay, that's a very simple way of doing owls. Just the straight down, but you can do other things as you can see with my... Um, I'm just letting you know how to draw these. I think these are amazing, aren't they? And owls, you can do sort of all sorts of colours on them and things like that, can't you, as well? I'm not going to copy. I've already done the copies, but I'm going, to, I'm going to do some. I think I'm going to do some more today using these. But I've already done the copies of what I'm going to um, do. I'm going to go on the outline of this as well. Okay, so let's find another one uh, that we can do. Uh, another, that's a very simple, it's like that but with feet <laughs> and an outline. <laughs> I just accidentally cut it out, I don't know why. I don't know what I was doing. Um, right, um, let's think of the other one to do. Oh, is that one? That's similar, isn't it? So you could do one of those. Um, let's do it. I'll do it straight with the outline. So you could do it with pencil. Oh, don't put it outlined. His beak or his um, head. You can also do patterns on them as well. Um, I've done. Uh, let's see if I've got my thing. Well, I've done on one of them this, which I think is a really cute little. So this sort of thing. Um, you can echo it round his head. Anything like that, and round his tummy head. And, Anything like you can do stitches as well. They'll, they'll. Uh, that's fine. Just put a little cross over them like that for decoration. That's cute, isn't it? So you can do anything like we did on the anything like you did on the um, whimsical doodles, uh, or anything you like. You don't have to do this at all. You can leave it plain. Yeah, why right not? Okay. That's it. There you go. Oh, I haven't done his beak, have I? I found his beak. This is uh, called bright yellow, apparently. There. It looks orange to me, but it's called bright yellow, and that's fine. That finishes him off, doesn't it, nicely? Right, so let's do the similar thing. Okay, so this is a similar thing. That again. Now this time we're going to stick out some... Um, and it's the same it's the same design really let's do his eyes and beak and then his legs 
you don't have to do legs or anything you like you can do them you can do them straight sticks because if you if you don't fancy cutting them out but um okay i just done like a bit it's like a big mouth to me sometimes <laughs> that's the design right and then i've got my wings here look you can do them what size you like and what shape you like okay and i've done some some reason i've done that um got he's got one eye bigger than the other but that's fine right then let's just quickly color on him in Yeah, there's your idea for those, right? Okay, so you've got other 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 ideas as well. Let's have a look. I'll do it a bit further down because I've, I've got it close up because I've just got to remember that. <laughs> um, let's think of another idea we've got. Oh, what about him? Is he too... That's he's too advanced at the moment. Let's have a look. I've got those. I've got this idea of um, this cushion that will make. <laughs> right. Um, so, right, so, all this one is, is quite simple. I, d I forgot to do the wings actually on the, uh, I will show you later. So it's just a little shape like this. Okay, you can do it with a pencil and you can just make sure they're level if you like. You don't have to, you don't have to be level. But it, look, this is actually quite big, isn't it? Yeah, this is quite big. It's bigger than him. It's going to fit in there. <laughs> but that doesn't last. And I've given him glasses. Okay, so what I've done. I must remember to do the wings as well. Right, so what I've done for the glasses is just done it straight across. Okay. And then I've uh, decided how far they need to be. They can be a bit bigger than that. And then you can just draw some glasses like that and I don't know why he needs glasses. Why do you need glasses? <laughs> Got good eyesight. I suppose they have, haven't they really? Right, and then I've done my wings from about here, level with, not, not quite level with the eyes actually, but <laughs> I've done that one, which is fine. And then I've done sort of like the wings like this. So that's another style you could do for that one as well. Okay, and you've got um, this idea as well of a pattern. I don't know how I did it. I think what I did was actually instead of that, let's just get it like this. I think what I did, which might be easier, is this. I'm not sure, actually. <laughs> and then... Um, choose a point and just do that and then you just, just join them up here join all the bits there we go and then you just color them in, in individually you put pupils in him as well yeah like that and you can give him legs and you don't have to give him even legs you can give him legs like i've done there Oh, that's a new one <laughs> see that looks totally different to that because i've widened it i've actually a bit too wide so if i'd done that in pencil i could have rubbed that out and i made it a little bit slimmer right then let's have a different let's have a nice pink one shall we pink mr pink this time
yeah I'm avoiding trying this because obviously this might make the black run <laughs> so I'm trying not to get onto the black to go rub over the black that's one thing you have to watch I suppose right another idea let's have a look uh, see that's a pretty similar idea to that more of a round so well we've got room yet more of a round one okay these are quite big aren't they normally I've gone quite small yeah so um, okay so choose I would say two thirds of the way well third of the way down then okay we're going to do a we're doing a head and I'm doing it like this so do a little line there line there and somewhere in the middle we're going to have a little point like that so that's basically the head and then you can put the wings there and a little tummy idea there um, okay you can show you can have the then the same length i can't remember if i did that actually i must have done yeah i must have done it like that. and then um eyes well that's not as big as the other one you can have a bigger beak instead <laughs> there we go or you can let's work it might it might go over the top see if i can make them a little bit bigger that's a good thing about unipost because they do tend to i don't want to rub the in case it's still wet yeah and then we can go around that in black in a minute when it's dry right okay then obviously we can color that in whatever color we like okay so let's get i mean i'm using not just using unipost because i'm using um these brush marker pens this one's an aqua so it will go in water but i want it thick so anything like that so that's basically that one but I've varied the colour there he like a big brother to that isn't it now <laughs> he's a big brother right okay oh yeah you've got you can do little you can do little ears if you like as well yeah that's a good idea he's got little ears but he hasn't or oh, whatever they are the tufts of fur aren't they tufts of uh, feathers Right, so there's another one there. Okay, that's a fairly good one. Um, what, where should we move to? Down here. Got room there, yeah. Right, so let's do him. Let's do that one. Okay, so you could do it. You could oh, let's do it in a in a in a um, crayon, so that I can um, go over the line. So it's basically any shaped head so just a circle there another circle for the body and you can do it away you like you can give him less shoulders because sometimes they put the heads down don't they <laughs> so that one's got quite a bit of shoulder that one i'm going to move this one down so and that's not intentional that's just because it's happening at the moment that's why not because i intended to do it right so oh yeah i've got him um so I've got him up with ears, so then that thing there, whatever that is, can be made into ears. And then you can bring it and then you can, ooh, there. Well. So we can do that if you like, or you can leave it round or whatever. You don't have to do that. So leave it a round head or do that. Um... Let's do this. Okay, 
so we've got some big eyes i'm going to measure these actually so you know how big they are because i haven't done that yet have i so they are yeah i would say two two and a half to three inches you don't have to do the feet like that i got it you can do it hat the feet how you like or not or just sticks or whatever or don't have feet or I forgot about his beak didn't I owl's beaks tend to be sort of that shape but they probably vary let's have it in the same colour head I think yeah One thing I don't do is do them. I don't do them with green heads. <laughs> I don't want them to look ill. That's the only, unless you unless you want them to look ill. There's a reason, but I wouldn't do them with um, green heads. So that's him, yeah, there he is, yeah, done him. So you can do, uh, as I say, those sort of things. You can uh, do patterns on him. I tend to do it somewhere else, which looks rather cute, doesn't it? And then, um, oh, there's all sorts of birds. Let me show you them. Obviously, I can, you'll be able to see on the all sorts of things I've done okay this uh, that one's the same as similar to that one. Oh, and I've done you a tummy lock so you can vary the you can do mix and match yeah I've got the window cleaners here at the moment <laughs> cleaning the windows hello I can't see they can't see me um there we go they're using poles <laughs> so there's that idea as well Oh, this one I like a lot. That looks like a, a Disney one, doesn't it? So that's got more of a round head than this one. Um, let's give me yellow beak. Can't go yellow beak. Oh, give me yellow beak. All right. So that's got more of a, and he's got um, like straight. Let me show you. Um, where are we over here? Yeah, I can show you here. All right. So this one is more like. Um, no, nope, I'll do it. Shall we do it in? No, I, I drew it in pink by the looks of it. Let's draw it in pink. You can don't have to do it in. Um, if it's like that, like that, and then you've got down to there, and then a big body. Yeah, and it looks like it looks like a dis. It reminds me of some sort of Disney owl I've seen. On a Disney, um, but I don't know what. <laughs> okay, and it wasn't intentional, so. Okay, um, that sort of thing. I've done his beat like that, but it's just got that. All he's got is those tough things there, so I've gone around the edge, even in black. And cut them out. 
<clears throat> and there is a trick to um, some of it. I haven't even gone. I haven't even gone around in um, thick black pen there, have I? I've just done it straight, and that looks fine. So what we're doing here is mixing and matching, okay? Mixing and matching, you can do all sorts of combinations. I'm going to do yellow, uh, yellow. There we go, yellow legs. Yeah, okay. We're having yellow legs there. <laughs> no, <laughs> actually, it's not. Um, so I've given him a bit of a shaky thing there. Okay. Oh, it's given him a yellow beak. I've yeah, I did give him one. Oh, he's got a yellow top there, haven't he? You can do what you like. Don't have to do that. Yeah. No. I'm getting um not getting black everywhere, yeah. It must be the uniposcus can't be it's either because they're still wet or they're not uh, yeah. Could be that. Right, and then we can have a pink face, can't we? Slightly different to that, yeah. Slightly different one. Gonna go around that one with um, black. Here it is. Okay, so I can. Yeah, he's got not quite got quite that look as he as the Disney. Never mind. <laughs> there we go. Is that? Um, are we able to see it? Yeah. So it's quite low down, but at least you're able to see it. So I'm going around this for a reason, but you don't have to. Uh, you can do, always do this other thing that I did. Wait a minute, let's have a go. So you've got those, you've got, that's cute, I love this one. Which is very, is it similar, have I done that one? I haven't done that one, have I? Uh, it's not much different to that one really just stick the wings out like that and the fact it's that one isn't it really uh yeah it's that one uh, that one is um same as this one really just varied things and these my mini ones look very cute aren't they look like ch i just definitely look like to me children's book um drawings and if you've got grandchildren, you can always get them involved. Children or grandchildren. Yeah, children might enjoy doing it as well, even if they're a bit older. <laughs> it's fun, actually. Right. Um, I don't know how, because a lot of people I know are um, around my age or older or younger <laughs> who watch me. Right. Oh, that one's another one. Okay, this one's a different one. Look, I've done him in square eyes now. I've got that idea off my um, box. box so i've got this with all owls on it so let's find the one i've done with the oh there it is i think that's the one so well, that is based on that one i think or very similar see they don't even look like that one didn't even look like an owl <laughs> but uh, yeah it still works doesn't it so you can anything like that you can even do those i, I think these are sort of like done with sort of some sort of printing idea yeah so you've got that idea as well um they've even varied them like this they've got one with shapes one side and one with sort of um flex the other okay like that oh that's what i did lot didn't i like there you go and i've done him that shape as well with the feather sticking out and he's got his feathers uh yeah a bit, bit like this so i've done those as well so i've done that's um another idea right so what i did then i stuck them on two let me just get that out a bit because we're a bit low aren't we a bit right so i stuck them all onto a uh, black paper and copied them as you may imagine <laughs> 
So uh, yeah, so I cut them all out, fussy cut them out. I stuck them all onto black paper. Okay, in the, even the legs. I forgot to do his wings. I told you that at the beginning, didn't I? I forgot to do his wings. So I have to keep drawing them on. And I forgot to do his legs. <laughs> so I just keep drawing them on. Um, okay, so there's all the... If you want to have a look, there's all you. Yeah, I might put that on the community so you can have a look. Uh, them all the all the designs obviously you can mix and match in fact i'm going to put some, let me put some wings on him this is how i do his wings all i do is this i don't want to encroach on that because um i need to leave a bit of a gap for when i do the um round so it doesn't seem to matter that it doesn't color properly yeah there we go so that will be different shape to the one i've got before and i just put his i do short legs because obviously it's i didn't realize that i'd stuck it down and you can do it in whatever shape you like you can have them like that so like some of them look like the walking as a disney type that's i didn't copy it as a disney i just it just happened to look like it some of them look like they've got their hands in the pockets, don't they? Strolling along. And some of them look like they've got their heads quite low down. Casually, you know, as you do. And um, that one looks fairly angry. <laughs> sometimes that looks... Sometimes I can see that as a big open mouth. But I'm going to... Might have to do something in that one as well. I, to, I don't know whether this... Oh, not that. Let's get me pen. Where's my pen? Um, I don't know whether this would actually work, but... I was thinking of doing that. Does that make it work? Oh no, I think that makes it better, doesn't it? Actually making them look like he's got a bit of a head rather than that's the mouth. <laughs> that's the only trouble with that, isn't it? There we go. Anyway, look like I so much look like children's books. Um, so you could put them on black paper anyway. I was got I've got the idea off that Mary flower. What she did was put a children or a, I think she copied a grandchildren's work a lot of the time and just put it onto black paper and it gives that that massive outline. You might not like the outline, but I like the outline. And I've cut it. It's a bit easier to cut out as well, especially the legs. Um, so that, uh, that's a bit raggy there but that doesn't matter to me at all right okay so what I'm gonna do is uh, right, is continue with these okay but I'm gonna use that as your guide because that's what I'm using at the moment I'll put it on the community um, oh yeah you want to see these yeah, so this is what I've done as well. So this hasn't printed brilliantly because my printer won't, it won't, it, you can't get rid of the lines sometimes. But luckily it's not too bad. Um, yeah, I've tried to clean the heads. It's like clean the heads, clean the heads. Nothing's happening. <laughs> yeah, I'm afraid. Yeah, so, that, so that's all those, as you can see, all in, um, in miniature. So I've cut a lot of them out. So I think they're absolutely um, amazing. I don't um, think I need to show you that, do I? Don't need to show because all I've done is stuck them on paper. I mean, they've even got black outlines on them as well. But I've just made sure that there's uh, plenty of room to for the legs and everything. Okay. So you can see all the little cute, absolutely cute. Let me just show you what, what I tried tried with that. I haven't stuck them in yet. So, so I've got my um, journal I'm going to send off in the next few days. Just a minute. I have to move over there a minute. I've got a journal I'm going to send off in the next few days. I've got my cat there and everything. Um, I was thinking it, they look, it looks, even on, oh, I'm down there on this. Um, you could put them on there, the mini ones lot. These lot amazing. Yeah. Anything, any any order, anything, okay. 
that so you can do loads of variations of what I've done I say they are three inches tall um, width wise let's have a look I'd say one and a half yeah he's about one and a half inches wide than his wings would make him two and three quarters so it's about one and a half there and he comes to two and three quarters there so that's almost a square isn't it from in fact is that bigger than th no it's exactly three inches yeah i thought it's about two and a half to three inches i've drawn them so that might help might it if i tell you that and okay and these little ones these are i've done them as a i don't know so they fit on a page um tw th four times so they come up as just over an inch yeah so it would be just over an inch by an inch there so that's that one and three quarters of an inch three quarters of an inch by one and three eighths of an inch that one is that's the sort of size they are i mean i some i wish i some i sometimes think i wish people would tell me the size <laughs> so that's why i'm doing it for you <laughs> right okay and that one's i've put legs on him this time okay and there's one with the yeah i think they're quite subtle as well as some uh, because this is quite colored but i've got black lines around the outside another thing i did was put some on here i thought these were rather cute i think i did the big ones as well or did one big one? Oh, I tried the big ones down the, down the belly band, which is, yeah, no, I've not tried that one. I have to try that one. And there's that one. And then you could put another one, different one. So you got four, three owls down there. Can we see that? There they are, lot. Move this down a bit, and then I've got more of an idea of where we are. <laughs> I'm useless, aren't I? Yeah, so there's your. Um, yeah, I do, I'm not very good at and knowing where to, where to, to um, where the camera is because I, if I can see it, I assume you can. That's the thing. That's what it is. Yeah, and it looks. I've already got a butterfly on there, but you can add an owl or you can add an owl instead, and you can put them. I mean, I've got a coloured page there. Let's see if I can get some. I've got some blue ones. I don't know why I want to put blue ones down it, but they'd look rather cute, wouldn't they? Or you could ah, another thing I thought of, which was cute, was just grab a grab about three little ones, and you could have them as a little um, thing on the page like that. They look cute. They're really cute little characters, aren't they? But you could do that with big ones i don't know don't forget this is a small um tn so it's a very um it's a miniature thing and uh, yeah so you could put him there and then him there he's hiding a bit isn't he? i'm hiding from you um and i get another one that one that one too similar let's get me disney one <laughs> the disney ones might be similar to that one all right there we go um yeah, you could have them at the bottom of a page as well. Obviously, in another journal, that might have more room. Um, that's rather cute, isn't it? So I'm definitely going to put some in this journal. My favourite page that year. Right, I'm going to make a pocket of some sort. And I'm going to put them on it, I think. That's what I'm going to... So I need to make at least one more pocket in this journal. Let's see how we'd look with them down there. That would look quite nice, wouldn't it? I was looking, thinking all the ones you couldn't journal on, but you could journal on that, really. And I know that uh, the, my partner's not going to... She's going to just keep it, because that's what she does. She's not going to do anything with it. Right. Um, how about those? Oh, yeah, they sort of match those colours, don't they? <laughs> yeah. Ah, this is the one with me. I've got that. So that's contrasting. Going to do some pink ones down the page. Yeah. Or you can even do mini ones down the page. Because I've got loads. 
I cut out, I think, quite a lot of these. Yeah, so if you want, because it, I think when you've got, um, like you do them big and then you miniaturise them, I think that that's a good idea if you can do that. Or get somebody else to help you because, um, you know, it's, uh, if you haven't got a printer, for example, or you've, oh no, <laughs> perhaps we could do this, look, because obviously it doesn't matter how they are in this page because it's not going to be able to write on it now you could do a couple of that yeah. pull big one of her and then she's flapping about a bit isn't she and then you could put some other one. that's right you join him and then um whole page of them yeah you could even even overlap them all couldn't you I don't know, put crowds of them. <laughs> if you've got a, ah, that's another thing. If you've got some, and it doesn't happen, it only happened with owls. If you've got something else that you want to cover up that you didn't like, you say, oh no, and you've, or you've unglued, you know, you've, un, and you've torn it off because it's glued, you could put something like that on top, couldn't you? Yeah, they're flying away. They have actually got the wings out, so they could be flying, couldn't they? <laughs> yeah. So well, that was trying to fly as well, and that one. Right. So that's uh, the ideas. I do hope you like uh, my content today, and I've given you some ideas to of what to do, um, because I am um, I am so awed by that lady. Who did <laughs> she did an amazing? Yeah, Mary Flower. You'd have to look. Um, she, I, I didn't get the idea of this from her, but I'm definitely going to have a look at some of the stuff she's done because uh, it's amazing, and I'm going to add it in my journal. Um, okay, it's not this sort of thing, but she's oh, it's her grandkids have done some amazing stuff, and it shows you how to use their drawings. So that's another thing. Okay then. Um, so uh, do you hope you like my content today. Please give me a thumbs up. That would be absolutely amazing. And um, if you subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much. I'm going to see to him. Don't worry. I'll put him on some black paper again. And um, <laughs> give him some legs. <laughs> and. Um, in fact you could put him there. Yep, so I'm possibly putting these on Kofi if you want to have them. But this is the I this is the first impression, so that's what I if I put them first impression, you can get a, a re high resolution copy as well if you want to grab them. Obviously, you just don't tell anybody it's your, your own work. That's what you could, all you have to do, and uh, you can use it to, to journal in journals you've got intended to sell or anything. So don't worry about that. Oh, well, you can do this as well. Perhaps you could even. Oh, no, it's good. <laughs> Perhaps you could. Oh, he's there similar because I I got the I copied them. You could put on a big, massive um, pile of them. You can glue them all on, on. <laughs> have them like this. Yeah, you could have a massive crowd of owls, couldn't you? So the gathering of owls. Okay. Um, put him down there. Yep. So I, I say goodbye and thank you so much for watching.